everyone, it's TVC Mario, and you're here for another edition of Satanic Illuminati New World Order Exposed. In today's video, I wanted to go ahead and begin to expose the biggest PSYOP that I've ever seen ran in America, targeting Christians, specifically Republicans, and also the truth movement. This is enough. I stayed quiet for a while because it takes courage to expose this, and I'll show you why. There are people within the truth movement who are controlled opposition promoting this shill. And they themselves are shills. And they're going to take very weird and fishy tactics to silence people like me. And for a long time, I've backed out and I haven't done anything and spoken out. But that's it. I've prepared myself legally to go ahead and speak out because this is freedom of expression. I'm allowed to have my own opinion about what I see going on. This is not defamatory videos. This is me sharing and expressing my freedom of expression and my beliefs. I believe Trump is a shill, and that's not defamation. I'm allowed to that. You shills. All right, so stay tuned. I'll tell you exactly what's going on with uh, the shills that are uh, threatening law cases against people that will speak out against them, etc. That's at the end of the video here. Some really prominent, uh, well, one prominent truther did it, and I'll show you exactly who that is. And uh, so let's get right into this. The first thing that we need to point out here is um, uh, he does this 666 Illuminati hand sign more than Lady Gaga. Like, if you are doing the 666 hand sign more than Lady Gaga, there's something going on. For those of you who don't know, this hand sign, okay, is part of the secret cabal, okay? It's oftentimes held over the eye, and the three fingers are distinguishable because they all make up a different part of the six, okay? So it's a 666, six, six. and you can constantly see Lady Gaga doing that, you know, People might do it coincidentally here and there, but in reality, I mean, the, the way that she does it is just obvious that there's something else going on. And we see the exact same thing here with Trump, constantly, constantly showing this Illuminati hand sign. Okay, and why is that? Well, that's because he's part of a secret society of Freemasons. Okay, he's doing the pyramid hand sign here. Notice when he does interviews, he's always doing this. Notice from now on, I want your eyes open. Okay, pay attention to the hand signs that they're constantly doing. Okay, Trump is the worst I've seen worse than Gaga, okay? So it's blatantly obvious. The reason that they do this is because the Freemasons are part of the mystery schools that make up the Illuminati network. I'll go ahead and leave this video in the description section, Satanic Illuminati Freemasons Exposed. And one thing that you need to check out here is the Freemasons do hand signs all the time. It's one of their forms of communication. They'll communicate to one another by doing these things, okay? So here you see Kanye West with his hand over his chest, which is a Masonic hand sign. And well, what's this? Oh, he just happens to be doing it there. And always doing this. And always doing the 666 hand sign like he's Lady Gaga on steroids, okay? So this is a big psychological operation, okay, by the Masons. He's a Mason, he's a sellout. Uh, in my opinion, by the way, let me just state that. I'm allowed to my opinion. I don't have 100% fact that states that, but I'm entitled to, to, to think of my own ideas and I don't buy it for a second, okay? The reality is there are secret societies that operate and these individuals aren't public. There's ways to identify them. So in my interpretation, this guy is obviously showing all those signs. And one of the things is I'm gonna hear it on the, in the comment section. Well, well, why don't, what do you mean? You can't vote for Trump? Who are you gonna vote for, Hillary? No, no, 100% proof elections are rigged. Your vote doesn't count. I'll go ahead and leave this in the description section. And I also just did a video on Hillary Clinton being a Lucifer worshiper, okay? New World Order Luciferian Socialist Exposed. Go ahead and check that video out. So this is not a promotion for Hillary Clinton. This is not a promotion for any candidate, in fact. It's a truth video. And you know what the truth is? The truth is that they are putting you back asleep, okay? Would you want the blue pill or the red pill? It doesn't matter, they own both sides. You know what's really interesting is this. I've been witnessing. What in the world has happened to Alex Jones, ladies and gentlemen? He has completely turned against the truth movement and is now nothing more than the truth movement's version of mainstream media? 
Okay, let's th let's let's pay attention to this. Watch this. Alex Jones, two-party dictatorship. This was part of the Obama deception back in the day. And he's talking about, well, why two parties? Uh, Alex Jones, don't you dare send a copyright strike. There is uh, fair use. So I'm going to go ahead and play this very short clip, not even very long. Why is there two parties? Because it's a two-party tiered system. As he was explaining back then, they control both sides. And then it, it's connected. Total control. Okay, what happened? Whoa, whoa, people, step back for a second here, please. Why did he give us truth and go right back upon that truth? And now when you go to his channel, it's like watching Trump promotion. It's all Trump, Trump, Trump. Yeah, 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 we gotta vote for Trump. Trump's our answer, everybody. America, America will be great again if we go for Trump. No, 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 no. What, what, what is this? What, what? Are you kidding me? You double speaking liar? You come out several years ago telling us the truth. This is the truth, by the way. This is how, by the way, controlled opposition sucks you in. They give you a little bit of truth at the start, and then later on, they start hitting you with the lies, okay? Once they they gain your credibility. Why would he, back in the day, say that the two-party system totally controlled, and now he, he's sending his reporters to the Republican com, uh, conferences and doing these big interviews and promotions for Trump? How does that make any sense, everyone? Please, tell me. Okay, why? This is a psychological operation designed for the truth movement. Uh, this guy, in my opinion, Alex Jones and everyone else, this isn't defamatory. You're a shill. You're controlled opposition and it shows so obviously by what you've done with this Trump propaganda nonsense. You are literally trying to make people fall back asleep, Jones. You want them to take the blue and red pill? Is that what you want? You're promoting the red pill. Hey, everyone, let's take the red pill. Vote red. Vote red. It'll make a difference. Don't vote blue. No, no. Voting red or voting blue don't make no difference. They're both controlled opposition, okay? They're both a scam. It is total control. They have both sides. He was right back in 2009. Now he just went completely backwards on everything that he showed us. So anyone out there who supports Trump, who supports voting, you're no longer a truther. You've been disqualified. The very foundation of the truth movement are these fundamental truths that we recognize that the bankers, the elite, the globalist Jones, and the ones that you expose completely control the election system. So don't you try and put us back to sleep with your red pill nonsense okay red pill blue pill it's not like the matrix one doesn't wake you up and the other one keeps you asleep they both keep you asleep in this case okay so it doesn't matter you can go ahead and swallow the red one or the blue one they're both laughing at you at the end of the day the controllers okay this is what the globalists want they want us to fall for this insanity of thinking well let me just vote over here for trump or vote over here for clinton and there's going to be change in america no the globalists are still going to run the country america won't be made quote unquote great again it's a divide and conquer tactic okay this is what he's doing he's instigating division in america that's why there's riots taking place at his uh conferences people are showing up and causing fights uh this is part of the agenda okay he's inflaming the divisions in america because he's a controlled shill okay and his buddy is the clintons they're friends so th this is just what you see on tv it's like wwe but in real life they're buddy 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 and they know well hillary's not very exciting no one's going to vote for hillary so how do we make sure that hillary gets into office which she will she's already selected because as is stated presidents are not elected they are selected Okay, so she's already been selected, but it would have been hard if she had any type of Republican that would have been for the people, not a controlled opposition shill who the media makes you think is against him so that they create the image that he's anti-establishment to deceive those who don't understand the truth about the world, the political system that we live in. He is only running because it takes away any opportunity for anyone else to run against her because she probably wouldn't have won very easily. She's not very interesting. Even the people that uh, are Democrat are having a hard time voting for her, okay? So they needed to make sure that they sent in him so that she would be guaranteed a seat as the president of the United States, the first female. Watch, mark my words, he's not going to win. This is all a psychological operation. Keep you asleep, keep you taking down the pills so that you stay sleeping. Mark Dice has often, uh, you know, 
well, in this one video and another video that I've documented and I've, I'm going to be passing on to my legal team, this guy actually threatens to sue YouTubers that talk about him and expose him, quote unquote. Okay. So, uh, yo, Dicey, you, you're, you're basically threatening me in this video. I'm not dumb. Okay. When I saw this video, I knew what you were doing. I had to uh, remove all my Mark Dice exposed videos, contact a legal team. Now I know my rights. Now I know what's going on. You don't have a, a case in the world against me. I've documented to the fact that in these videos you even go on and admit that you would be filing a case just to cause a headache buddy you went ahead and spilled the beans not too clever so that's passed on to my legal team by the way i'm a canadian if you sue me and i win which i will win you're gonna pay for all my court court fees and everything so let's go to court uh you shill you snake lying threatening Little snake. You, you know what's ridiculous about Mark Dice? Back in the day, he used to, to, to attack Alex Jones. I actually got subscribed to Mark Dice because he had uh, Alex Jones exposed basically every Friday. It was He would make fun of them. And all of a sudden, whoa, he's on the Alex Jones show? What, what, what happened there, Dicey? You know, why are you back on the show, bud? It don't make no sense to me. But anyways, uh, I, I can have my own my own thoughts and feelings about this. And if you really want to court, go to court, buddy, we'll go to court. Now, I'll leave this in the description section for you. Donald Trump is a Christian, true or false. If you think he's a Christian, you don't know the Bible. You don't know Jesus Christ. You don't have the Holy Spirit in you. This is obvious. He doesn't know the, the true gospel. I exposed it on my biblical studies channel where I analyzed him. It's a joke if you think he's a Christian. Please don't fall for that deception. All right, so there you go, everyone. The biggest psyop that's ever been run by shills within the truth movement to the divide the truth movement, putting the majority of uh, truthers back to sleep, believing in this two-party system and uh, believing that their vote counts and going out there and Trump 2016 and getting all involved in this nonsense. The main thing about all of this, follow Jesus. He is the king of kings. The, the American system is completely corrupt, period. They're not going to put a president in there that's going to really be anti-establishment. It'll never happen. Trump is controlled opposition. They're going to keep doing this, guys. You should anticipate that there's going to be an individual every time that's presented to you as anti-establishment. You're going to hear on the media that the media is going to say, listen, oh yeah, we're against Trump. We're not going to air Trump. And then you're going to sit back and go, because you're going to fall for the propaganda. You're going to go, yeah, yeah, yeah Trump is anti-establishment the media is not not with him well there is a media that's with him if you pay close attention guys okay there is someone in the media that's promoting him and it's within our own ranks it's within our own movement okay it slithered its way in here this psyop so wake up have a blessed and wonderful day stay vigilant don't drink kool-aid the truth or kool-aid that's being passed around it's putting you back to sleep stay vigilant fear no evil Well, thanks for watching my video, everyone. I pray that it was a blessing to you and that you really, really did uh, enjoy it. Uh, I just wanted to let you know here, I do a lot more than just the content that you typically see me doing on this channel. This channel is dedicated to exposing the entertainment industry, new age movement, new world order, and to getting the gospel out to people who normally wouldn't hear it. I have a backup channel that is identical to this, so go ahead and check that out. All the links are always in the description sections. I also have a health channel if you want to go ahead and get healthy, which is God's will for your life. I have a Bible study channel. Check that out and be edified as we study the scriptures together. Also, I have a godly manhood 
YouTube channel called The Godly Bros, where me and my brother in Christ, Alex, seek to encourage our brothers in the Lord. And also, I have a Christian music channel. I review and share Christian music with you all. And I'm also on Facebook, so make sure that you check that out. I upload different videos there as well, and I'm also on Instagram. So all the links are always in the description sections, and you can find them there. So have a wet, blessed and wonderful day, guys.